Hi guys, so this is the next video in the chapter 17 series. So today we'll be looking into classifying information systems according to the usage. Executive support systems, decision support systems, management information systems, office automation systems, knowledge work systems, transaction processing systems, business intelligence systems. Now let's look into each of them individually. Executive support system. These are the information systems operated at strategic level, developed to provide the required information to top level managers to make decisions. The strategic level managers often have to make non-structured decisions which do not match with the predetermined problem solving structures and this system helps to make such non-structured decisions. Decision support systems. These are the information systems that are used at management level. These can be introduced as the type of systems with analytical ability that assist middle managers to make uniform structured and semi-structured decisions which cannot be determined easily and keep on changing rapidly. For example, structured decisions could be calculating of the EOQ according to the formula and semi-structured decisions could be investment evaluating decisions. These systems are used in various management activities, especially at preparing plans, formulating structures, evaluating alternatives, and making decisions, etc. Management information systems. These are the information systems that are used at middle management level. The information systems that assist middle level managers to make planning decisions, monitor and control. These are the information systems that assist middle level managers to directly reach the current performance and past reports. These systems provide information in the form of reports at a specially required occasion or periodically in the uniform way as whether daily, weekly, monthly and annually. Examples of periodical reports daily sales report, for monthly receipts from data reports, special reports would be providing a report regarding a specific section when the management requests for it. Office automation systems. These are the information systems that facilitate to copy data and information electronically and to communicate them in the same form. These are operated in knowledge level. These are used by assistant accountants, secretaries and clerks, etc. who engage in affairs related to data processing. Since they engage in distribution as well as in consumption of data, these systems comprise of techniques for pasting and communicating the data. Hence the goal of the office automation systems is to facilitate e-pasting of data and information as well as communicating them in the same form. Examples for preparing documents, word processing systems, for communicating information, email. Knowledge work systems. These are the information systems that assist in knowledge employees in generating and integrating new knowledge of an organization. These are the information systems that operate at knowledge level. These are the information systems that generate information required by knowledge employees such as engineers, doctors, lawyers and researchers etc. Since these are for persons who generate knowledge, these systems are not in uniform. Examples Computer Aided Designing Transaction Processing System The information systems used to process data generated from daily operations of an organization are known as transaction processing systems. These are the systems used to process basic data generated through frequently occurring functions of an organization. Reporting and necessary updating of the data relevant to daily operations are done using these systems. There can be several transaction processing systems developed for each department of an organization. Examples mostly they used for production division, to purchase materials, to order materials, and for marketing divisions to receive selling orders, to price the goods, for financial or accounting division, to prepare budgets, 
to prepare general ledger to make cash payments for hrd or human resource division to prepare pay sheets to record employee attendance for training and development business intelligence systems these are the systems that strengthen executive support system these systems are developed using data and information which are to be used for decision support systems these are systems that comprise of abilities processes technological usage and practices even though the systems are classified on usage in the above manner there is an interrelationship among these systems the relationship among these systems can be depicted through the following diagram the above arrow heads shows the direction of flow of data accordingly the transaction processing system of an organization are the information systems that provide data for other information systems like dds mis and ess receives data from mis and dss so that's it with this video guys please do like and share to learn and let others learn thank you created using powtoon